Hey guys, it's Glad here with Dark Cloud, and um, we're going to floor eight. Yes, floor eight is uh, apparently a normal, uh, not normal floor. We get our new character there, hopefully, unless the guy fucked up again. And it's like, uh... mm, never mind. Yep. Uh, Question marks. Hmm, some guy on the ground. Huh? What, what's happened? <laughs> oh, that's right. During the test flight, the body fell apart. Darn, I wonder what went wrong. In theory, I was, it was supposed to be perfect, and I thought I was, a side part turned into a weird ball. Maybe it's just my imagination. Oh, and who are you? Well, anyways, let's go back. Oh, he has a propeller. What is that pack thing? Okay. Cool. Can you fly me to all the way to the fifth floor without having to go through all those floors? <laughs> Okay, where is he taking me? Oh, okay, cool. He seems like, f like from Blue Terra. Why here? Genie. Oh, that. I saw it with the big telescope. It's not that much. It's not much evil. The big Terra folks need help if they are in trouble. So by by so little evil. What? Seal it? You must be kidding. Sealing is like extinct. Thanks. No one in Yellow Drops knows how to seal properly. Isn't that even that when you put something into a urn or something, right? That is impossible. Wait up. I haven't said it no yet. I just said the sealing technique was difficult. There's a cooler way than sealing. Just knock it down. Don't worry, I'll, t I'll take care of it. Count on me. Here's the plan. I am all in the process of making a so-called sun giant. <clears throat> it's a studio art yellow drop technology. Let's say it's like a super-sized golem. It's to make a long story short, the Sun Giant could easily knock out Genie, but then this very Sun Giant ran away and broke into pieces during the red test drive. The magical gem we have now is not powerful enough to support the Sun Genie. We need a Pez Sphere to make the Sun Giant perfect. A Pez Sphere is one of the most powerful of the magical gems. If you use that, then Sun Giant will operate at its slap best whip. It has been put up as a prize for a match of the at the Coliseum. If you could win the match, you can acquire it. Easy to say, but winning a contest it takes hard work. That means let's join forces. Osmod, yeah. Osmod is now the ally joined join as an ally. Freaking rabbit. They're all freaking rabbits. Can I shop here? Oh, it's a shop. Awesome. Um, oh, that's expensive. Let's buy a few. Oh, we need to, you know, sell, okay, let's sell some those. We don't need exactly a lot of those. Forgot my uh, inventory, but there was full. I don't need a lot of these guys. But I, in order to level up um, X and L's weapon, I need to get a few of those. Anything else? No, no. Just 
fishing. And the easy you can put your money into um, gold Bolton, and so you can um, keep it as an item. So, like, say you die in a um, dungeon, and um... ooh, there's stuff here. Metal breaker, fruit of Eden. Anything else? That looks like it. So yeah, like I was saying, uh, so you don't you don't need to um, waste your money. You know, keep most of it on um, gold buttons, and there you have it. Hmm. Keywords realized: ancient treasure, brave bark, our fire holy and immortal, immortal, talent, whatever, rock bird, metal wizard. Don't forget that only a particular sword can build up into a brave arc. Okay, um, you should know I um, lost the Sun and Moon sword. Yeah, and I, I was about to heal it, but last hit, you know, now I'm not going to play. Go back and do two floors just to get a sword, which I'm not going to use much, sadly. Yeah. Anyway, um, shall we go to the Moon Sea and check out Osmond? I hope he's better than the others. Except he's never gonna be better than X, you know, whatever her name is. She, 77, actually, what, huh? When we get in there, we're gonna just check something. Critters 8. Don't tell me. Okay, go. Oh yeah, we have to go back to this floor. Of course. We got everyone. All six people. Let's look at our weapon. 77 for 3 for attack. Endurance, 99. Maxed out. Speed, 77. Well, not 97. And magic, just a little lower. Let's see. Build up. I need to build up beast and dragon. And, of course, flying. Okay. Of course, so let's go as Osmod. He's a flying dude, look at that. Ah, oh, he's a freaking machine gun! You know, you think, beginning of this game, you think it's a medieval game, but no. Prior to the gun, and <laughs> he's like, Scared. Well, let's play around with him a little bit. Okay. Okay, that's pretty cool, actually. Reload. But it's so fucking weak. How much does it do? Holy shit, machine gun looks like a freaking, um, what you call it? Nail gun. <laughs> it does. I'd add something to it, like, oh, I don't know, endurance. What about, um, oh, holy shit. This is why I don't like. <sighs> Give him some ice. For a metal, too. Attach his weapon to ice. Which probably does nothing because I have no magic points. He sucks. Let's go over here. Because he sucks because I haven't upgraded him. Bam. Look at it. If I can upgrade him a lot, he'd probably be strong too. Awesome. You also notice the map is brighter. Because I changed the. Um, apparently, I went to the menus and changed the um, map density to 3, which is better than 1. Oh, full. Yeah. We can toss this bomb shit away. Should have sold all that crap. Throw all the fish. Actually, I'm gonna do that off-cam now. Whatever. Um. So 
Let's go ahead and tell him. Grab him. Yeah, now he's on his weak ass dagger for now. Let's see what's this? And I believe um, uh, we're continuing this the next episode later on. So maybe 14, 15, 4, 15, I guess. See you there, I guess. So see you guys later. We're building the sun giant, I guess, whatever. So, whatever. See you guys later.